This is your diamond insight for tonight of police and journalists. We do not know why our police service, if at all it is a service, is so scared of journalists such that the only thing they know is locking them up when they are suspected to have committed a crime. Surely, can police and journalists work together in the execution of their respective duties? It is strange that even where journalists are trying to accurately gather news to inform the public, police would push around the men and women in the media. Indeed, the arrest of movie TV journalists Innocent Piri and Obvious Kapunda is totally unacceptable. What is so complicated about arresting Mr. Chinufia Tayali? Does he carry weapons or is he some sort of a rebel leader? What we know about Mr. Tayali is that he is a media tiger without a member of parliament, mayor or councillor. And in a country which has freedom of expression such as Zambia, Mr. Tayali can be managed. We are not supporting Mr. Tayali in any way, but we are concerned about our colleagues at Movie TV as police are driving fear in the men and women who are expected to inform, educate and entertain the public. In fact, police are driving fear in all journalists who won't be comfortable to cover the arrest of suspects who are harmless and don't carry weapons. As former police spokesperson Mr. Lemi Kajoba, who is now Inspector General of Police, knows that journalists mean no harm to the police. It is only thing that journalists want to do is gather a good story and air it or write it in the newspapers for the public consumption. We know the challenge that our police officers experience in their execution of duties. The challenge is simply the use of modern methods of investigating, arresting and prosecuting suspects. It appears we still have the same police force which believed in a suspect being guilty before being proven innocent. If Mr. Tali has committed an offence and the evidence is overwhelming, why not effect an arrest and present him before court? Why would police extend their anger to Mr. Innocent Piri and Obvious Kapunda, who were simply capturing the arrests as journalists? We can honestly say that in trying to please the appointing authority, country Zambia, President Hakainde Hichlema is on record condemning the closure of media houses and he is also against arresting suspects before a crime is investigated. Police can do better than arresting journalists who are harmless.